What's going on, everybody? This is Al from Instantly 06 Revival. And in the last video, we took on Air Force. It was a low-scoring game. Defense played great, a whole lot better than I expected, going up against a triple option attack. They done well. Offense, we done just enough to keep our lead. And to get the W, we're 7-0. We're 17th in the country. But today, we're going to take on the most important game of the season against Utah. They're the best team in the conference. Beat them, then we can maybe win the conference championship because I'm pretty sure there's no conference title game in the Mountain West. But either way, they're 6-1. It's going to be quite the battle. You can see here they got pretty good talent. This was fresh off their greatest year they ever had in their history. That was Urban Meyer's last season at Utah. That was back in the year 2004. This is 2005. So they still got quite a bit of talent to work with. Just looking here, their offense is just spot on. It looks like they're doing pretty well, both running and passing the ball. Defense is just kind of right in the middle of the pack. But it should be interesting. They are a spread team. I mean, I'm pretty sure that their playbook is really close to what Florida's playbook is, a la Urban Meyer's playbook. So I kind of know what to expect, but again, it's all based off of where their talent is and working off of that and adjusting accordingly. It is a home game. Which means we do have some visitors coming in. Should, hopefully. Yes, we do. Center. He's ready to take a visit. I'm going to go ahead. I'll probably do Northern Arizona. That's why I scheduled it. For that reason alone. I have no need for him to come today when I, he can come next week. Free safety. He is ready. I'm going to do Northern Arizona there. And that is it. The rest of them are holding true. This other free safety. So we're in good shape with all four of these guys. So just really nothing we had to do except schedule a couple visits for next week. Again, that's the reason why I scheduled the Northern Arizona game. Gives you a 12th game, and it gives you a good one for home visits and whatnot. We got three home games out of the gate right there. We must have front-ended our schedule with away games. I think we got maybe one extra. Maybe a seven and five. Either way. Gonna be a wild game today. Let's look at Sports Illustrated. We're starting to hit turn four of the season. The last stretch. So some of this stuff is gonna be halfway important to us. Bowl rankings, we may actually be on this list. No, we're not yet. Heisman watch, Jaja -Ja Riley. Um he had a really good game. He's up there number one, which is crazy. I mean, it's gonna be wild if I win a Heisman with this kid. I'm pretty sure I won't, unless the touchdowns just go up exponentially which is the reason why he's on the list, but good for him. He's having a great season. I've been able to work around his talents. Players of the week, I don't care. Conference standings, we always see this in the preview of each game. But there we are. It's us in Utah. We already got a win over Wyoming, so we got a game up on them. We haven't played Colorado State. I don't remember if we have already. Anyway, they're 2-1, but today's the big game, us and the Utes. That is it. One thing I'm going to do, I, I didn't change the playbook any. It stayed like this all season pretty much ever since I made the switch to like a four-set offense was I'm going to play around just a little bit with gun two-back slot. I want to do some gun triple option type things. I want to get my two running backs, which is technically my two best skill players on the field at the same time. And since I got Rocky Hines as a running quarterback, I think it'd be a good idea to do a little triple option a little small package, and we're going to use gun two back slot for that. I could use gun split because my tight end, I like to have him out on the field. But I like a few extra plays from here, so we're just going to go with that. Otherwise, the offense is going to stay the same, and I'm just going to sneak in some gun two back slot every now and then. Okay, let's go ahead and take on Utah. First of all, happy Super Bowl day to you all. I'm not a fan of either team, but I'm a big football schematics guy. I enjoy watching the strategery between these teams. The NFL, they're always a leg up on a lot of things, and I really like what Kansas City does in the passing game. I like what San Francisco doing with, you know, they're running and play action, and their people are having a really hard time stopping yet. So it'll be fun to see both of those two offenses go at it. It looks like Utah has a couple of starting linemen out. At least one. I'm sure that center is a starter. 
Brad Johnson, if you remember him, I think he is the offense coordinator. No, not anymore. I don't know where he went. He was the offense coordinator at Utah. Now he's somewhere else in, oh, what's his face? He used to be the offense coordinator at Vanderbilt. He's at Utah now. Brad Johnson's out there coaching somewhere. But I remember him playing. He should be number three, if I'm not mistaken. All right, I'm with the ball second half. And I accidentally missed the preview. I'm sorry. I completely forgot. They probably was going to pick us just because we're ranked and Utah isn't. I just hit the X button, so sorry about that. Okay. Brian Johnson. Sorry, not Brad, but Brian Johnson. Yeah, he is number three. He can run some, so I'm not going to blitz him too hard. Looks like they got a decent little group of running backs. Impact receiver. Decent guy behind him. Pretty good receiving group. Not much a tight end. All right, 92 at left tackle. 87 at left guard. 6'7", 310. Ooh. 90 at center, but he's out, so his backup. I can go after him some today. 80, so right guard and center. I'm going to be over those two guys at defense tackle today. And their right tackle is out. So they got their backup as a defensive tackle. That's crazy. I guess we're going to try that. I don't know. It's going to be kind of weird. Defensively, I think they run a 4 3. Let's see, 78, 90. Defensive tackle, 90. That's the kid that's playing, if I'm not mistaken. See the right? No, Salah. He's a third stringer. So that actually kind of works out for him. That's weird that this guy could play both ways. You don't see that. You can't find a recruit that can kind of do, but it's, you have to find an athlete to do that, like a 300 pound athlete. Sometimes they can play both ways. 72, 80, and 91. Okay. Corners. 82, 80, 76. 82 and 91. Okay. They got a kicker and they got a punter. All right, they got a good little team. Should be interesting. They got to play well to win. It's going to be shoved to the sideline a little bit. It's a long kick. Good stop. We'll go quarters for now. We're going strong twins out of the gate. There he goes. Somebody get him. Pick up a first. We're going four wide there. It's more like it. I'm pretty sure most of their... Playbook is gun sets. Go this way. Just a bad throw, I guess. They got sweet uniforms. We'll just think of quarters again. Let's do that. All right, third and six, maybe third and seven. We'll go cloud. It's third down and six to go. Ball on the thirty-yard line. We'll do that, and we'll spread it out. Pick up the first. He just found an opening. I'm going to stick with quarters. Just keep everything in front of us. I'd rather them go down the field with 15 plays than do something really quick. Didn't get much there. That's good. Second and long. Good open field tackle by Geis. Now it's third and long. We'll go back to Cloud. I'd like to try to get to him, but I don't want him to run off with it either. I'm going to cut across here. Johnson, set to go to the air. Look, he's going right. 
Uh-oh. Get a block out there. There we go. Great play. My other defender was able to swat it down, and the guys was able to come over and pick it up. He had all day to throw. Nice. So we are on what yard? The 30? Roughly. Let's go ahead and... Oh, that's the, no, the free safety is the bad one. I mean, he's not bad, but he's not as good as her strong safety. Let's go PA boot. We're going with zone. I'd love to go for cover two. If not, I'll roll out with it. Sack out of the gate. Yeah, just good defense. Oh, and he injured his hip. No! Well, that ain't good. Uh, second and 15. We got to pick up some of those yards back. Let's just stay here. Let's do a toss play. We'll see how bad the injury is before we make a decision on that. We're going zone. Get a block out there. Didn't get the first. I probably could have put my head down on that one. I'll go slam. Now for the game. Well, I mean, it could be worse. So I'm not going to burn a red shirt or anything. There's no point in that. Okay. Well, so much for that two-back slot stuff he was going to do. Uh, let's do another toss play. They're going 4-3. Got two impact linemen. You don't see that too often. Oh, good defense. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. Oh, what a crazy play. We got lucky. We got the ball back. <laughs> Two fumbles. Defense end just destroy that play. So we're on the left hash. Let's give our quarterback an easy throw. We're going zone. Sarutini. Get some of those yards back. Let's just stay here. Let's go P.A. Reed. We're going zone. I'll probably just toss this back to Jackson. Good play there. He got caught up a little bit. I don't know if you saw this. My left tackle bumped into Jackson. Slowed the play down a little bit. Look at this right there. Bumped into him. Kind of threw off my timing. Thankfully, that guy pursued too hard. You're able to cut up field. Okay. Now, let's just let Jaw Jaw take care of the rest. We're going zone. Ooh, yeah, we're going to go left. Get away from those impact guys. Mm. Oh, what a play. Awesome play. That was fun. Let's go back and look at this. So I put my head down. That's right stick up. And then I went back to my speed button to try to break the tackle. And his size pretty much carried him over the line. Awesome. All right, good start. I hate that our quarterback is out, so we're going to have to work around that a little bit. If we go back, I just need to look at this since we know Sartini is going to be in here. Throwing power and throwing accuracy. Johnson behind him, 6'4", 240. That's my kind of quarterback right there. Somebody humongous. He doesn't have a great arm, but I like just humongous quarterbacks. Anyway, he's got good throwing power, so I may try to go deep a little bit more because of that. He can toss it kind of far. And he can't run to save his life, but we're going to let Sartini handle it. And Unless he keeps throwing picks or something, then we may adjust. But I think he'll be okay. All right, let's get back on defense. Seven plays, 27 yards. <laughs> Good stop there. That's one of the, that's their impact receiver. We'll go quarters. 
I could have went dime. I just now thought about that. Nice. I forced him inside. That's interesting. I done a little scrape exchange sort of on the right side. And somehow my defensive end was able to cut underneath. Good deal. We're going back to do I have the, the corners to do it? I don't think I don't like to run a ton of dime unless I just have the, the cornerbacks to do it. And I kind of do, so I need to run some dime when they're going five wide. So let's just go ahead and do that. We'll go quarters for me it. And ooh, I'm I need to check my formation subs. 74, hmm, he's probably got the better awareness. So I'll just leave it as such. Oops. Oh, good play. Almost got the first. I was able to cut around that. Did you, did you see that? I was right here. I got around him quick. I mean, I don't know if I was because I was up a little farther. So I'm back a little bit more. I don't know if the extra half a yard helped. Either way, I couldn't get to the quarterback, but I was able to make a move initially. Uh, they are, yeah, we'll just go one high. At a 4 3. Third down and short. Ball on the 32 yard line. The youth line up in a goal line formation. And I forgot, I need to be a defense tackle. Ah, oh, what a catch. Pick up the first. Let's go back to quarters and nickel. First and ten. Ball right around midfield. Four wide. They'll throw on first down. Ooh. That'll drive the coach. We'll just stick with quarters, it's fine. Oh, man, I was right there. He's gone. Ooh, it's a big play. That's a good... I like that halfback direct because you got weird blocking situations. I think sometimes work better compared to have, like, gun spread. So that gun... Uh, Gun two back slot version's pretty good too. I, I put that on Instagram. I need to try that the next drive and see how it works. But that one, and this one out of gun bunch is pretty good. He's picking us apart. We can't get to him yet. Of course, I'm not blitzing hard or anything, and nor do I want to. Like I can do that here. We can try it. I don't think it's going to work. He's already ran around a couple times. I see that. Get him. Oh, it worked. All right. He he bit on the fake, This my blitzing linebacker right here. He went after the running back, and then he cut up again to make the sack. So where are we at? Third and 11. That is the end of the quarter. It's where you want to be, though, third and long. That's the goal. Unfortunately, there's no cover three or, co or a cover six in dime. Or I would probably go to a dime package for that, but they just, they're just just not here. The youth set up in the gun. Let's see. He keeps it. He's down. Now, they may kick a field goal. Pat. I think they're a little too far out. Yeah, they're going to kick a field goal. They can have it. He was feeling the heat. I don't know if that was for me or for what, but he ain't taking much time before he decides, miss it, miss it. Yeah. Woo. Now, going back to that gun two-back slot play I was talking about, let me go put in our sub package here. If I can find it. Halfback direct from here. Let's see. They are going zone. And they're doing that. And I just kind of follow my blocks. I do not use the speed button. Got a few yards out of it, but they was coming from the outside. Uh, let's go halfback option. 
Should do a toss plate or go in zone. Ooh. Let's do this. I didn't want that to happen. Pick up the first. And, it looks like there's an and we got our alignment out. I hope you're right. Okay. And I forgot to. We're going man. I forgot to do my package. Or my uh, sub package. Right. Yeah, that was a good throw. I need to do my sub packages. I, I forgot on both of them. We'll go here and here. There we go. We haven't really had to use them yet except for that last play. But at least we got that going. I'm going to go back here. Um, I had it on my mind. I want to try that play again. Let's just try it. Let's go back to halfback correct and see what they do. We're going zone. They're spreading that way. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> Hit dive. Let's go P read. We're going zone. Out for a quarter, so somebody's out. I don't know which one. He's only out for a quarter. Ooh, man. You saw my pocket presence here. I don't know how to teach this to you all, but as soon as I snap the ball, I'm looking at the line. I, I, this particular play, I know the ball is going to go to him. He is my zone beater, so I don't have to look at him. He's going to run his route regardless if I look at him or not. So all I have to do is just look at the line, what's happening on the line. So as soon as I snap it, I see that linebacker coming in the blitz. So I don't know how quickly he's going to get to me or what. But as soon as I'm able to throw, he's about to sack me right there. So here I am. I'm just backing up, backing up until I have, I know, you just got to know the timing. But he's made his break. So I know I can throw it. If I throw it too hard, I would have got sacked because it takes longer. But I was able to jump it just enough. We got some of the yards, but at least we didn't get sacked. Third and three. Uh, oh, uh, let's let Jackson run it. We're going zone. Four three. At least the linemen aren't shifting. Pick up the first there. I want to go here. I'm going to go with an RPO. I love this RPO. This is, it's got like answers for everything. They're going zone. Probably give this to Johnson more than likely. Not a very good throw, but he got five yards. He had to come back for it. Let's let Jaw Jaw run it here, get a manageable third down, or he can pick up the first. All right, they're going zone. And they switched up their impact guys. I don't know if you noticed that. I'm going to read that corner. Nope, don't have to. Pick up the first there. Good play. Let's go halfback tackle. They're going zone. We'll probably go left. Let's just go here. Good block there. Mm. Pick up the first. Now, I'm going to go. I'm going to go to my tight end here. We're going to go tight end cross. We're going zone. I hope they go cover three or four. That would be amazing. If they go cover two, I don't know if i got enough room to throw this to Marshall. And nope. That was a terrible play. They went cover two. We can look at this. 10 yards is really, I mean, technically 15 yards is really not enough to, it's tight because the safety's got nowhere to go. So the window is tight, and they went cover two. So I could have went to my post, and I backed up way too much. I didn't need to do that. Like, I could have gotten to him over the top. It just, it had the throw had to been spot on, and I made a dumb mistake by throwing it to my tight end. Only cover three and cover four could go to him on that play. Uh, I'm behind the chains, so let's go back to Trips Attack. We're going zone. We'll just give it back to Jackson. 
We are on the... They'll probably go goal line. Um, if I had to guess. I want to go... I don't have that play. Dang it. I was thinking... Um, let's see. Let's try it. They're going man. They're going nickel. Interesting. I, I didn't know they was going to go goal line or not. They're going to cover one. Oh, just outside of it. That was a good try. They went cover one. He's my cover one beater. Actually, a decent throw, just a little too far. Uh, let's go with a field goal. Try to stretch the lead a bit. So we need to go downfield a little bit more. Sartini can make those throws. I mean, he can throw it far. Don't know how accurate he'll be. So I'll try not to forget that on the next drive. We'll run it, and we'll go deep a little bit. His accuracy isn't all that great, so we can go run play action, basically. Try to go over the top if we can. We'll probably have better success that way, if I had to guess. We'll find out. Uh-oh. Somebody get him. Well, at least he didn't take it back. All right, they got two minutes to go. Plenty of time for them to get down the field. Been a defensive battle so far. That was a good hit. Hit him as soon as he tried to catch it. We're going five wide this time. We'll go dime quarters. Oh, my gosh, I was right there. Oh, my gosh, somebody tackled him. And I just dove into nothing. I had him, too. Man, that was close. Defense tackle, super close on getting him. All right. That's a good run by him. You can't blame him for running. He's got the speed to do it. Let's see. We're going gun two back slot. Let's do this. Wow. What a play. Just a one-on-one -on -one situation. Had all day to throw. That guy's much bigger. It was a good try by my defensive player. Just didn't work. All right. Well, we got a minute and a half. We're going to try to use that as best we can. And score. Stretch the lead and get the ball started second half. And he tacks on the extra point. So it's just over a minute. He just had all day to throw. And I don't want to blitz him. I mean, he'll just run out with it, and he's done a pretty good job of that so far. That's just what you deal with with a running quarterback. He's more willing to run than some other running quarterbacks we've went up against so far. Another player hurt. Okay, let's go. I have an idea. Let's go PA flat choice or go in zone. We'll leave it as is. There, a great play. I didn't get out of bounds. That's okay. Uh, we need to get towards the sideline. Let's go five super short post. We're going man. He's being double teamed. Let's do that. Uh, let's call a timeout. Lost yardage and we didn't get out of bounds. So that wasn't a good play at all. Second and 12. What's... I got downs to play with. They're going zone. Oh, what a play. What a play! Go, Marshall! Go! Go! Ah. Much bigger play than I expected. Let's stay here. I want to go trips attack. We're going zone. We'll just give this back to Marshall. Easiest zone play in the world. Ooh, bad throw. He threw it way too vertically. He's supposed to go to the sideline. 
Didn't work. That's okay, though. We're where we need to be. Maybe we can just let John try handle the rest. We're going to let the clock run. We're going zone. Uh, hmm. We're still going to go left. I'm, I'm a little worried about that impact guy on the left. But we got a big, huge hole right there above the B gap. So let's see if we can attack that. If they don't work, we'll call a timeout and run it again. Call a timeout. Uh, let's do a toss. We're going zone. I want to flip that. It's going to look really goofy doing it. Let's see. Thank you, face mask, and the clock should stop. Should be an automatic first down. Half distance to the goal, and the clock should stop. We gotta watch this here, just make sure it doesn't screw us over. Nope, clock stopped, and I'm at. Oh, that was my last time out. Uh, let's just go ahead for the touchdown. This may work. The impact guys are on that side. Didn't get it. Dang it, dang it, dang it. Should have kicked a field goal. Oh, hopefully they don't screw me over later, but they just done a good job. They stuffed it. So the stats aren't worth looking at because neither team didn't do much offensively. Not really. But I'm not too worried. I feel like we're playing pretty well. Would have been nice if we would have scored there, but I just didn't pay attention to my timeouts. The, the clock was supposed to stop off of that penalty, and it didn't. It went down. So I don't know what to do about that. I mean, I had to call a timeout. But I guess I could have kicked a field goal, but no well. I ain't going to worry about that. All right, they're going man. We're going to do another toss play. And we'll just go this way. Pick up the first. Uh, I don't want to go after that. I'd rather go after the free safety. Their strong safety is really good. So let's go back to PA flat choice. We're going zone. Cover two, it'll go to Marshall. If it's cover three, we'll go to Standia. Nice. What a throw. Six points. Over the top. Great play. Just enough. Man, those uniforms look good. Went cover two. I actually waited a little too long, to be honest. He went vertical a bit with it, but it was still a good enough throw. So we're going to continue to go after that free safety over the top if we can. With Sartini's throwing power, I think that's a good strategy. And let Jaw Jaw handle the running game. All right, got a 10-point lead back. Don't let this guy break free. Good tackle there. Let's go quarters at a 4-3. I can't get to him. I knew I couldn't get to the quarterback, so I just backed up and played coverage. It didn't work. I'm just too slow, but that was a good throw, though. He's tearing up my quarters right now, but we're going to keep doing it. We'll just see. I may start blitzing a little bit. They'll probably run out of it, but what do you do? Good throw. Pick up nine yards. I'm afraid to go man. I think he'll tear it up. And we can try it, but we're going. Let's just do quarters again. I may just throw a weird cover three at him, see how he reacts to it. Sack. Oh, my gosh, he had him. He got out of it somehow. That was weird. Go back and look at this. He was like, had a chance. He just bounced off of him. That's terrible. 
Got to make the tag on that one. Ah, oh, first down. Okay. Let's throw Cloud at him. That may confuse him a little bit. We'll see. Ball on the 35-yard line. Utah lines up in a shotgun set. There he goes. Still running with it. That's bad when your defensive tackle has to go over to make it tackle right there. But he's running a ton, so I may do some spy. I don't know. I, I don't think the spy plays work all that great, to be honest. I mean, we can try here. You got to have a fast linebacker to cover him or a safety. But even then, you just don't know if it's going to work or not. But with four wide receiver. Back to pass. Looks. He tosses it short. Complete. It's a good throw. He's just going right down the field. Everything in front of him on that play. They didn't pick up much on that play, but if they keep dumping it off like that, it's well, let's try this. We got a triple spy thing going on here. It opens up a whole other passing game. That's when you We'll flip it. I want my one high to be in the middle of the field. Uh, that was a good tackle. I don't think he got the first. Uh, please kick a field goal. I dare you. Ah, oh, they're going to kick a field goal. We're going to go safe man just in case they decide to fake it. Miss it. Miss it. Right in the middle. Well, at least he missed one. That was a good drive for him. Thankfully, we're just holding the field goals for the most part. Field goal and a touchdown is what they've got. Right. Let's get the ball back, and let's try to get another touchdown. Uh, I'm just going to let that one slip. Let's go slam. 4-3, man. Impact guys are on that side. The Rebel come out in a two tight end set. Nice play. Nice. Get a block on there. Ah. Big play by Jaja. I want to go back. Let's try and direct again. We're going zone. Maybe we can find something up the middle. I've had some success with that. Just, ooh, they're shifting that way. I'm okay with that. Good block there. Good block there. I right, get out of the way. Good play there. Now let's do... He's kind of gassed. Uh, but we'll do one more play with him. We'll go back to a toss. I'm okay with all that. There we go. He's feeling gas. You can see it. That was a pretty good run. Incredible effort there, running the football by this guy. I'm on the 24. Uh, I want to get my tight end the ball a little bit. Now they're going, man. We can try. That linebacker's on him, so we're going to leave that one be. Ah, perfect play. Good job. Great play. Okay, I'm on the nine. I'd love to. Uh, let me think. Let's go here. I know exactly. Tight end drag. I had it on my mind, so let's do it. We're going zone. And Stanley doesn't have good speed. So I don't know if it's going to take him a while to get over here. We'll find out. He is slow. He is slow. He is. I'm throwing that away. I may get a flag. No, I got out of bounds. Okay, out of the box. Yeah, see, the, this is a great drag play with your tight end going over. Problem is, Estandia is slower than Moses. He got caught up on somebody right there, too. That's what really hurt it. So, I mean, I probably could have threw it right there to him, but nah, it, just, it wasn't worth it. Second and goal on the nine. I want to do one small play first. See if that works. We're going man. Oh, I'd love to go my tight end. We could try that. The Rebel line up with three wide. He drops back. Look, fires. Nice. Ha ha ha. Six points. Out of boy to the big guy. He's huge. He's slower than Moses, but he can catch. What I've done here is you got a two out routes. You got one with your tight end 
and one with Marshall, your inner slot. I hot routed Jackson to a block because if you motion him out, that means his defender will go over there to the left, to our left with him, which means he can get in the way of our out route by our tight end. So it's easier if you isolate your tight end literally by himself. He has one half of the field all to himself. Thankfully, he was able to get up underneath his defender. So that guy couldn't make a play there. He, it was close, but ended up being a great play. Six points. You're going to see some of that tonight probably with uh, Kelsey with the Kansas City Chiefs. Hey, they isolate him all the time. Of course, they have him in the slot and out by himself. Hey, this may be a miss. No, we got it in. But he, they like to put him out by himself, isolated on one end because he's such a mismatch. He's tough to stop. So we'll see how all that goes. I'm, exci I'm excited to see that. I'm going to pay attention to the tight ends tonight. Especially since I just wrote a a 100-page book on tight ends. Shameless plug. Go out and buy the book if you haven't already. It's good stuff. Uh-oh. Somebody stop him. There we go. Okay. Let's get back. Game's not over. We're up two scores, but they can score themselves. Let's go to quarters. I'm not having a whole lot of luck on that guy right there. Let's try it against this. This right guard's supposed to be really good, but... Get him. Dang it. Just let somebody tackle and be done with it. How many yards has he got today? It's almost better if you just kind of let him run, if that makes sense. Just kind of let him get his yards. It takes him forever to get down the field. But We'll do this. Let's try. Uh, something worked there. Second 13. I'm going to do a weird cover three at a dime. Dog, eh, let's try dog three. This may be a mistake, but it looks good. Let's see if that linebacker can come in and blitz. Occupy. Forced him to throw quick, or I don't know. It was something worked there. All right, let's go back to Cloud. Let's go here. Great play. A 32. Whitley. Good job. Oh, they're going to punt it. All right. Let them have it. I figured they may go for it. They probably would have done it if it's in the fourth, but it's not. I may have some room on the left. Somebody get a block. Get a block right there. Thank you. Good run by Marshall. Let's go after. Marshall's kind of gassed, but we're going to go after that free safety. We're going man. So, they are going man. Do I have an audible for that? Let's go to... I know what we're going to do. It's going to make that free, that fullback really bad because they moved him to tight end. Pick up the first there, though. It's a good play. Exactly 10 yards. Now let's stay here and let's just run it. Let's try a counter. I'm normally not a fan of this version of counter. But if the blocking's there, it's great. But, and they're shifting. That helps. Nope. Came right on through. Eh. All right, that's end of the quarter. We got a two-score lead. Let's get that thing down. I couldn't snap it in time if I had a chance anyways. The last time we were behind the change, we went with toss, and it worked really well. He was able to get some yards back. We're going man here. Looks like we'll go left. Then after this play, we'll probably go back to tight end cross, which is a great third down play. That's good defense. He's not very fast, so a toss play is not the best for him, but he's got some yards out of it today. All right, let's go tight end cross or going man. Interesting. So everybody's an option. I don't know if I could get 11 yards with the tight end. It don't matter. They're bringing both safeties. Oh, what a catch by Johnson. 
Now, I'm on the 12. I am going to run the same thing. We're going man again. Interesting. I'm going to go to the tight end here. He's, they're going cover one at least. Nice. Ah, six points to the tight end. The big guy getting some love. He's a monster. Great play. Great man beater. Also a great cover four and cover three beater. That's just an awesome play in general. Your post is cover two. Your go route's cover zero. Your dig route is just a good man beater. Kind of covers all your basics. All right, we're really taking care of business. It's our defense. Our offense is playing good. It's good that Sartini is stepping up, but our defense is really doing a good job right now. Uh-oh, he gone. Well, so much for that big lead. No, we may get Oh. Well, I changed things a little, not a whole lot, but we're going to go with an all at blitz. I'm going to control the defense of tackle. That was a good shift. I'm going to go with the blitz. Now you could probably do it. I mean, he may score a touchdown off of it, but I think it's worth trying. Get him, get him. Nope, he got caught up. We may do that same play. We're going to do crash two. And I want a blitzer coming at him. We're going to fake it. We're going to flip it, I guess. Oops. Great defense. It's fourth quarter. I'm sure they're going to go for it, and they are. We're going to just run the same thing. I want him to throw quick. I want him to make a decision quickly. I guess we can... Hmm. Let's flip it. Get him, get him, get him, get him. Crap. He just had him there. That's a good play. All right. Now we're back down to two scores. So you do you have to start thinking running the clock a little bit. Keep running the offense like normal, but chew it up as best you can. And he tacks on the extra point. Time to take a look at the drive summary. It's brought to you by Okay. Let's get on offense. We're going to onside kick, which I think is funny. I mean, there's plenty of time to get back in it, but we're going to let that go. Let's get out of bounds. Let's give it to our best player. We're going zone nickel. I'm definitely going to go right unless they shift hard. I'm still going to go right. I like our tight ends against our corners. It didn't do as well as I thought, but we still got four yards out of it. Five yards. Let's go slam again. They're going zone. Guess we're going right. We're going to run clock. Then we'll figure out what to do on third down if needed. Get off me, son. It helps to have a guy who's strong. He can just break tackles. That's such an underrated aspect of a runner. The better who, who can just break a tackle, put a stiff arm on somebody. He's kind of feeling it. They're going 4-3, so I better stick with slam. Going zone here. We will go here. I want to read that corner. And just see what he does. I have him in view so I can work off of that. I could have went to the outside, but I think that defensive end was going to tackle me. Okay. 
Let's go Peter. Let's give Jaw Jaw a bit of a break. He was kind of gassed a little bit. They're going zone. We're going to give this to Marshall. Then we'll probably have a third down situation of some sort. I'll probably go to Trips Attack next. Since we know it's going to be on the right hash. Good throw. Pick up the first. I like the defense that was called. They just didn't make the play on the ball. You're right. It wasn't necessarily bad defense. The offense just executed and the result. I'd love to use some of those double option, triple option plays, but Rocky's not in there, so all right, they're going man. We're going to cut this to the right. Everybody and their brother's blitzing. Like everybody. I'm going to leave it as is, though. And I forgot the... I forgot the clock was running. All right. Just follow your blocks. Don't use the speed button. It's obvious I can't go left. They're blitzing from the other side as well because that safety came up. So then it's just down to just finding a hole. I'm patient. I'm not even moving the joystick hardly. Then I put my head down, knock him over, end up getting positive yards out of it. As long as you're patient with it, you know, you can find those holes and get something out of it. Is he gassed? No, they call timeout, so he should have. He should be feeling a little bit better. All right, they're going man. We're going to go a halfback tackle. Second three. Just about another first down will do it. Good block right there. I may have to run another one more. Just another basic run of some sort. Let's go. Let's just do a toss. It's been working fairly well today, even with how slow he is. They're going zone. We'll probably go left. So their last red zone visit resulted in a touchdown. Let's see if the defense can hold them this time. They go with the option. He laterals the ball. Cut up field, get something. Second and five. Let's just go back to slam here. On the 11, going, going in. zone. Looks like we'll go left again. The Rebel come out in the ace formation. Good win, though. Very good win. Defense played well. I mean, we gave up 17, but beating them by a couple of touchdowns, that's good. I'm happy with that. I know that's not probably what some of you are expecting or wanting. I mean, it, I'm not getting the struggle, but I'm just playing smart. I'm doing that, and I'm just pretty good at this game. It just, it is what it is. They call the timeout, so we'll just call the same play. One thing I know I can make things harder on myself is to, like, not do certain things on defense. Like, well, I could talk about that in another video. I don't need to do that here. But I've had some ideas of what to do. I mean, you could tell certain things work really well on defense. I'm a big quarters coverage guy. It helps me a lot. Uh, run a ton of man. That'll make things harder for you on defense. That's for sure. Fourth and three. We'll just kick a field goal. That's one thing I thought about doing. Just drew a lot of man. Probably it just That'll make your defense a whole lot harder. And the games would be a lot more closer. For me, it probably would. That, and I could do some more riskier things on offense. A lot of what I do is not very risky. That's why I don't turn the ball over a whole lot. I know what I'm doing, and I'm doing making safe throws, stuff like that. I can make that a lot more riskier if I wanted to. The kick is up. And it is I may think about that next season or something. I'm not going to do that this season. We're no point, but... All right, they got the ball back, 30 seconds. Sliders don't help you as much as you think. I know that's like the, the easy, lazy answer to things. Like, I just adjust the sliders. They don't, that's not that effective. It's what you do in the game that matters, not slowing down opponents. That's stupid. That don't make a lot of sense. You're dumbing down the opponent instead of, you know, trying to out-scheme them. Sack. First sack of the game, I think. Now that's some heavy pressure. It all starts with the battle of play. I don't care how good your receivers are 
But one thing you can do is definitely uh, is schematically. Oh, he got another sack. I'll be at the last end of it. Is to just do some different things on offense and defense. Things are a little harder, like man defense. Maybe do more riskier plays on offense. Play action, going over the top a lot more in terms of attacking deep coverages. You, you're just prone to throw a lot of picks that way. Stuff like that. But that's for another video, another thing down the road. All right, looks like our season is just cruising around along. Again, I know I may be to disappoint some of you because it's not the struggle, but I just, I'm sorry. It just, I'm just playing good. So either way, all right, come on back. We'll keep this. No, wait, no, we don't have anybody visiting. All right, yeah, come on back. We'll play whoever's next on the schedule, and I'll talk to you later.